you are in the market to buy a home and you're, you're purchasing a home with a large amount of grass, there's a little bit of, of potential money there to convert that. This is Las Vegas Real Estate Now with local real estate expert Harvey Blankfeld. First, let's talk about a water conservation easement. Let's sure. talk about that because that's that's something a lot of people just don't understand. And I want to make sure there's a clear understanding of what they can and can't do. So if somebody buys a home and there's a note on on the uh, title, when you pull the title report and you see there's this water conservation easement. Re that, recorded easement. A recorded easement. So some, some homeowner in the past has had grass removed and been paid a certain amount of money to do so from the water district, from the water authority. Correct. Okay. As a buyer, can can I can I put that grass back? Is that something I can you, do? You can. Uh, there's steps to do that though. So okay. what we recommend is in that situation, contact the water authority, ask them their procedure to replace that. And what we found is the procedures, depending on when you the original homeowner did the conversion, okay. the procedure might be a little bit different based on what was filed at the time. Gotcha. So just contact them and, and have that conversation with them. There will be a monetary amount that they're going to give to allow for that to come back. Right. Um, you got to pay them back for at least what they paid out, plus I think some right. additional money as well. Exactly. Exactly. There's a little bit of a penalty interest on, on the money, but right. it's, not, it's not unreasonable, but if they converted... 10,000 square feet of grass into desert, that could be a lot of money. That's a big check. Back. The issue that we see a lot of that comes up is swimming pools. So swimming pools if right. putting on in that in that area. I mean, if you go through the evolution of the home process here, homes built in the 90s, late 80s, had larger yards, had grass. They had an area that they converted. Right. And now that, that new homeowner is looking at that property saying, that's a nice size yard. I would love to put a pool there. And they can't. They until have, they take care of this water easement but and, and yeah it's it's definitely something that is uh we, we see a lot of the document request side of it and it's a substantial amount of money anywhere from two to three dollars a square foot indeed depending on how much area that you would having have removed right so if you are in the market to buy a home and you're, you're purchasing a home with a large amount of grass there's a little bit of, of potential money there to convert that that you could actually take advantage of or if you're currently a homeowner right now you can take advantage of the program. I mean, it's a great program. It's trying to help us with our water yeah. issue that we have. Yeah. Um, and yeah. It's good for the environment. You've been listening to Las Vegas Real Estate Now. If you ever have a question about real estate or any other topics we cover, just call me off air or text me at 702-203-1165. You can also check us out on the web at lvrealestateradio.com or on our handle on social media at LV Real Estate Radio. 